Most of the time I get asked the question, do you need to know graphic design or illustration before making a logo animation? And the answer is, it all depends on the type of the animation you make in. Sometimes you need to draw to complete an animation, and sometimes you just need to work with the logo and the assets provided to you. And this is what we're gonna do in this class. We're gonna take this letter logo and we will add motion graphics to it. And the type of the animation we're gonna do is this bouncy reveal text animation with the speed line. Hello everyone, my name is Adam. I'm a professional graphic designer and animator based in Casablanca, Morocco with over six years experience. My most notable clients are Wondershare, Flexclip and Animaker. So the techniques we will use here are a bit repetitive and may get complicated if you're not too familiar with Adobe After Effects, but I did my best to simplify things as much as I could. This class is for beginners in logo animation because the techniques will be pretty much easy to accomplish, but a basic knowledge in Adobe After Effects can really help. So in this class, you will need Adobe After Effects, the latest the version, the better. You will need two free scripts, do it base all and create notes from path extended. So why learn logo animation in the first place? Why is it important? And beside the fact that it is cool to animate and it does make you look cool, it also can be part of the storytelling process of a brand and an animated logo can give more detailed explanation about the nature of the brand than a static logo does. So if you're ready to animate and learn some few secret tips and after effects that you can incorporate in your workflow, see you in the next lecture.